Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. So, um, in this video, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, oh, well, I already opened it up. <laughs> um, go over, I haven't gone over everything. I just opened, I ripped open one of the mystery bags from Community that I got because I needed to grab some pieces out of it. I was working on a mystery lot for a customer and, um, there were some pieces that I wanted to grab out of there. So, since it's already open and, um, let's just, it's in a bag, dive in. Um, it was ripped, so I, I had to put, we had to put it in this big bag because it was just like already oozing out. But um, let me dive into the rest of the pieces. Um, I only pulled out like three. And um, I always see these knots, these airy knots everywhere. Let's see what we got going on. Oh, I do want to say that this is the ring from the last lot, from the Texas lot, Waco. And it's... Um, it's real silver and I don't believe it's a real diamond I cleaned it up but it still needs a little bit more I just it's very dainty if I could get a zoom it's very dainty but it has cute little okay this is not working out we're gonna back up it's very dainty, um, but it kind of, you know, looks like a little bit like Art Deco. It has a nice little design right here. I just, I like the work, um, a lot of detail on rings, uh, the setting especially. And if it's my, my second finger, which is, um, not my pinky. Usually they just fit my pinky. Okay, so... This uh, bag is from the community, like I said, and it was $19.99. This was part of the bags that I got when the manager said she was gonna um, she was gonna give me um, two bags because they sold the bag that I initially picked out. And when I went there, I got three bags. There was an extra one. So let's just dive in. Actually, I'm going to put it right here. Okay, so I saw... <laughs> okay, so I'm excited about this piece right here. Um, I started collecting Betsy Johnson, for those of you who don't know. And I don't think this is a fake Betsy Johnson, but I'm not 100% sure. Um, she did a lot of um, layering. There's the tag, but that doesn't mean anything because there's a lot of fake Betsy Johnsons with tags out there. And I'm not sure. I'd have to do some research. Or Gina, if you're watching, well, you'll probably get the pick before this video uploads to tell me if this is real or fake. She's like the Betsy Johnson queen. Um, okay, this is not working out. So, we just have, like, some pink stone, some faux opals. Very, very cute. I think this is Betsy Johnson, um, especially since it has the little charm with the tag. Just, like, little accents like that. Um, I don't, I'm not, like I said, I don't know 100% for sure. Um, but this is going to go in my collection and if it happens to be fake, I am going to pass it on in a mystery lot. So here we just have your typical, um, bangles. All the stones seem like they're there. There's no markings. Oh, oh, hey, hi there. You're not sticking. So I'm going to test this for silver gold bangle and 
Okay, maybe I maybe I maybe I pulled too much. I think I pulled too much. So we have some more bangles. These look like baseballs. And this says Cookie Lee. Cookie Lee. I don't know if Cookie Lee did silver. I'm not too sure. Could test that. I can't keep up with all the designers and their stuff. This is broken, so there's not much I could do with that one. Uh, either craft lot or the trash. So we have some more bangles, and I think, yeah, yeah, these are all sticking. So the last lot that I got from Waco, Texas, there was that thick rope chain that was marked sterling was silver and a couple other small pieces so um i'm happy it turned out to be a decent lot for me these are like just like some creamy circular beads with some gold tones in them Oh, something is busted in here. Okay. So, let's see if I can... Oh, my God. This is a huge knot. Um, I don't even... Let's see here. Okay. I think I got it. It is just yanking with... Okay. Okay. So here we have some really fascinating blue gloss stones. We got some AB blues. Okay. And I don't know what kind of stone this is. It is not... I don't think it's... um. Oh my god, I can't think of the bluestone name. It's it's like 2.30 in the morning right now. So, um, while I'm filming this on a Monday morning, early Monday morning. Um, oh my god, I was just, what's the bluestone? It's going to bother me now. Sorry, I thought I heard something. Okay, so bluestone, bluestone, bluestone. I can't think of the name. It's gonna come to me. Lapis, Jesus, lapis. Um, I don't think it is lapis. It has a purple. T it's pretty. It's pretty. It's a big hunker, but I don't think so. Okay, so this is actually a funny story. I was actually eyeing this necklace, and I just couldn't find myself. I don't know what the price was on it, but I just couldn't find myself to buy it at the price that they had it at. And... Where is... Okay, here it is. Here's the big lobster. Okay, let me see if I could... Oh, no, it's tangled. Okay, so this big chunker has one, two, three, five strands. And there's different little keys on here, which I thought is fun. And we have the black metallic, silver, and gold. This does remind me of Betsy in a way. But I know this is not her. Unless, look at how cool that key design is. Look at this. Wow, this is fun. So see, it's a fun piece. And I just think it's funny and ironic how I was eyeing it. Or possibly going to get it and it ended up in my lot. I do, that does happen though a lot. 
So this is, it's going to take me some time, but you guys get the picture with all the keys. Okay. Okay, something. Okay. Uh, I'm trying to pull this stuff out. We have a neon ball earring. Okay, I'm seeing some. Okay, so this looks cool. Ouch. My nails are so thin from... I need it I need to get them done but nobody around here is open um, they're so thin I removed the paint and I cut them down so I actually recently ran into a necklace just like this where it has like the colored plot a rubber plus rubber underneath it and I thought maybe it was like real silver but it's not this is like a surfer necklace it's cool There's some big tangles. I don't know how far we're going to get into this. But, um, there's one necklace. It does have a lot of wear on the chain. I do like this right here. Yeah, that's cool. But there's a lot of wear on it. it. Just or it just feels filthy. This necklace. Okay, so okay, so here we have a gray tone um, on fabric, partial faceted crystals. Uh, these are plastic. They're not crystals. But I like the I like the gray tone with the clear. That'll that'll work. And it's in good condition. Okay, so let's see here. This is also really cool. I have to unhook it though because we have some faux, faux turquoise and faux um, coral. Actually, it was right there. It's a long necklace, but it has cute little design, like indentations on the chain. It's a cute design. Okay, so I think is this the one that's busted? Okay, so this is okay. This is like a tri necklace. It just looks like a regular Taurus necklace. What is this here? This is really cute. And it says... Um, I don't know. It's hard to tell, but I'm trying to get... The rest out of here. Oh, this is a 1928. That's interesting. I think I'm going to do a 1928 lot. I haven't been selling the necklaces that much. So I'll probably do a lot of the 1928s. I have some really great pieces in my eBay store, but they're just not moving. Um, okay, so... 
this tape causing all this ruckus yeah okay Franz, stop. <laughs> Franz is on a good one now. Okay, so here we have... I would have never thought 1928 would create something like this. But then the pattern in the back did make me think like, oh, it looks like 1928. So, um... <clears throat> We got all kinds of stuff on here. So basically, here's the necklace. Very dainty, but it's super cute. Especially if somebody has a sapphire birthstone, that would work out really good. Okay, there's a lot of tangles. Okay, this is really cute. I like this design. The stones are all there. Look at that. Look at the chain on this. I love this. De this de the design. It's kind of like the chain has like a little mini Art Deco signs in there. Okay, okay. Is there a maker's mark? No, but it's really cute. Very, very nice. Clean piece. Clean, not by saying not dirty, and also very nice. I think that necklace would do really well. Okay, this might be, oh, who's this? Okay, I've never seen this tag. I'm gonna have to get my, my loop. So this is very, very dainty and subtle with the stones. It reminds me of 1928, but um, it's not. This is, oh my god, I don't even know. Oh, uh, Bonnie, Bonnie J? No. Oh my god, let me see, it's B-O-N-N. -N. I don't know, Bonnie J or Bonnie L or Bonmu, Bonu. I have no idea if anybody knows in the comments, put it down. So I can't tell what that last letter is. Oh God, this is worse on camera. See? <laughs> At first I wanted to say Bombay. Bombay is a furniture company, but who knows? They might make jewelry as well. So I'll put that to the side. Um, yeah. Not too sure about that one. Okay. So, all right. So here we have like a little girl pink faux um, pearl necklace. Um, I see some big sparkles coming out of this one is it broken is it good oh i thought i unhinged it i think this came from a little girl or a young girl some of this jewelry some of it was stuff that they had out that obviously didn't sell but
No Maker's Mark. All the stones are there. Very clean. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna end right here and I'm gonna go into a part two because um well okay you know what actually no I'll take that back if the video completely cuts out I'm gonna put it in the title if it's a part one or part two but if it if it completely cuts out then you know that there's a video following up on it I don't right now I'm having issues and I can't upload it all as one so I apologize for that I'm just gonna keep moving though so sorry if I'm in the middle of talking and then it cuts out but okay so this is a hot mess oh my god these are not my favorite necklaces right here with the wire like I appreciate what they were trying to do with this design Golly, it's like, it's it's a hot mess when it gets tangled with other pieces. Mm. What are the, there's different names for this necklace, like the floating necklace. So this one has the cat's eye. We have orange stones, yellow stones, very earth tony. And actually, this has a lot of wear right there. It's, it is rusty. Oh, look at this. Okay, so this is very costumey, but it's all intact. The bracelet. We have like these uh, gray iridescent uh, seed beads. And... Like the little rectangle ones. All right, Bronzy, come on. So right here, this is all tangled. Um, we have some cool. This was a dollar at one time. I think this is glass. Yeah, glass lavender beads. And these are plastic. These are not glass or crystals. Okay, so, oh Lord. I have no idea what's going on in this seaweed tangle. So I'm filming this um, four days before Christmas. How is, well, does anybody have anything planned besides spending time with family? Or I don't know how in other states the perimeters are, but over here, nothing's open. And they're like, it seems like every week something gets set in place. Okay, so I think I'm going to be done with this because there's a lot of tangles. I'm not seeing anything like spectacular to pull out of it. This is a bangle. Here is another bangle it is not silver um so yeah does anybody have anything fun or is just gonna hang out with family um i can't believe how fast christmas came okay so this is interesting right here to me but do you see that knot right there Is this supposed to be like Chanel? 
No, this is not chenille. Yeah. Um. I'm just going to spend it with my um my family nearby. I have a small family. And then just hang out, you know, relax. Spend time with my son. Okay, so here's another necklace. I wish this prism like pendant would have been like instead of plastic, a crystal. That would have been cool. Okay, so this I think is a belt. NY. Yeah, this is a belt. It's a big old belt. Um, lots of okay. The 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 cool necklace with the keys and the Betsy, I like. Um, but I'm not seeing anything that was like jumping out at me. You know, these are very, very nice pieces. They, um, they're clean. They're, the majority of them are not worn out. So, what is going on here? Um, this is just all tangled. So, I'm going to have to spend time on it after. Oh, I wanted to see what this was. Okay, so I got to work on that after. Okay, so this is cute. Look at how cute. It's a, a little boy and a girl kissing. So this doesn't have a maker's mark on it. It has a heart. It's a cute one. I like it. Okay, I'm bringing in more stuff and it, it looks like everything is just tangled. Oh, okay. Awesome. That one came off. Wow, this is a big one. Wait, what's... Oh, it's part of it. Okay. So, we have this cool... This looks very much so like... Kind of like an Anne Klein piece. Or an Aldo. An Aldo piece. Might be. It's long. We got two loops. And we got the chains that are hanging. So obviously this one didn't sell. But it's in good condition. So that's more modern. Okay. So what do we got going on over here? I'm thinking. This is two. Okay. Let's take this out. This is a very, very nice chain. There's a marking on it. Let's see. Let's see what. Let's see what we find. Oh my god, it's so hard. Uh, mm. Okay, I think maybe I almost got it. If not, I'm going to have to move on. It says... Twelve K. I think this is gold filled. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> this is not 12k is it gold filled would it still stick huh i think i have to well it shouldn't stick does gold filled stick it says 12k but maybe it's 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 faded maybe it's gold plated It says 12K, and I, I can't read the other initials, but it's sticking to the magnet, so I don't think. I don't know. That's so confusing. Okay, that's 30 seconds or a minute of our life. We won't get back. Sorry about that, guys. No, Bronzy, you can't take that. No, 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 no. He wants to go to bed, so he's waiting for me. So he could lay down. I know, I know. No, you can't take that. No. Uh-uh. Come on. Here, I made a spot for you. Come on. Okay, so we just have like some chains off of a... Off of a uh, necklace dangling. Um... Nothing like spectacular. It's just very common. Oh my god. This is too. Wait. Is this the same one? Oh, it is. It's missing the. St oh no, they didn't. Ah. Oh, there was a big amber stone right here. Faux, obviously, but I almost bought this. I remember. I was looking at it. They broke it. It's ruined. And it's, um, I forgot who R is. And I remember I was just drawn to how it just gave me, like, the Victorian vibes of, like, the, the ambers and, like, the chandelier look. But I didn't buy it because... And it had a beautiful stone right here. It's probably in the bag, broken. Um, I wasn't buying. If they would have just put the stone attached to this, it would have been fine. This made it too like too cartoony for me. I don't know if that makes sense. But wait a minute. It'll still work. You know why? Because I could remove. 